The energy exploration deal between Turkey and the Libyan government of national accord, which Turkey militarily backs, is a big victory for Ankara, not only financially, analysts say. Libya is helping Turkey achieve economic rewards that are going to be substantial, and in the process, it is humiliating Greece. So this is the political aspect of things. The Libyan deal allows for Turkish exploration in Mediterranean waters claimed by Greece. Analysts say Turkish and Greek forces already regularly face off in disputed waters in the dividing Aegean Sea. The Libyan deal is now threatening to expand those rivalries. We see in the past that there were face-offs uh, near the uh, waters uh, in the Aegean. We've seen Turkish provocations uh, in the territorial waters of Cyprus. Uh, the question is, uh, as you've seen, the, uh, the Greek government is incredibly uh, angry. Greek Foreign Minister Nikos Dendeas held talks in Cairo recently with his Egyptian counterpart Sami Shukri, and both countries condemned the Libyan energy deal. Cairo also announced it's suspending talks with Ankara that have been aimed at improving strain relations. Analysts say nations in the region are getting drawn into the dispute. You have this entire croissant, if you will, like going from Greece to Cyprus to Egypt, and I insist on the Egyptian aspect. Because the Egyptians, really the way they look at the eastern half of Libya, for them it's their own back backyards, and they don't consider it uh, acceptable at all that Turkey might conduct business uh, in, on land or under the sea. France, a strong ally of Greece and Egypt, also condemned the recent Turkish-Libyan energy deal as a violation of international law. France and Greece have a bilateral defence agreement. Paris is helping Athens modernise its military forces. Both sides are also aware that that could result in a fully, fully, you know, full-scale war. Right? Because you don't just have Turkey and Greece in the Eastern Med. You have other countries. You have the French, you have Israel, you have Egypt, you have... I mean, you know, the Eastern Mediterranean right now is a huge geopolitical zone. So in that place, you know, you don't, you're not just going to have the two actors and then others just watching by. The next potential flashpoint could be if Ankara sends its energy research ships into Greek contested waters under the Libyan deal. But precisely because the stakes are so high for the region, analysts predict all sides will work to avoid any confrontation. Dorian Jones, VOA News, Istanbul.